Hi everyone and welcome to the Freelance Channel. Today's video is a quick update for those who have been asking about eSIM. Now I've read a lot of comments and one of the most common issue is with the QR code not being received and therefore could not install the eSIM that they paid for. Now unfortunately I cannot personally answer and tell you what to do about that but my best recommendation is of course to reach out to Globe's customer service. However, if you want to try it again and buy another SIM just like what I did, you can go ahead and watch this video to see how this new option works. For this update, let me make sure that we are on the same page. To start with, please make sure that you have the latest version of the Globe One app. At the time of this recording, I am currently on version 1.9.17 and I'm using an iPhone 14 Plus. The reason for this video update is because there's now an additional option of installing an eSIM. In the first video that I posted, the only option was for a QR code. In the latest version of Globe One app, aside from installation via QR code, the new option is to install the eSIM directly right after you purchase the eSIM from the store. Now, if you're having issues receiving the QR code previously, this will hopefully be a more convenient option as it will be downloaded and installed right on the phone that you used to purchase the eSIM. This doesn't eliminate the QR code being sent. You will still be able to receive a QR code, but if you will install it directly and it doesn't work, the good thing is that at least you have a backup option if you have the QR code. So to demonstrate, let me go ahead and purchase another eSIM. The purchase process, it's, it's of course pretty much the same. So the first step is to open the Globe One app. Now, previously we don't have the SIM hub, but in this latest version, you can see the SIM hub. But if that's not working, then go back and from here, choose Essentials. Then choose Prepaid eSIM. So from this point forward, all you need to do is to follow the prompt. Choose your payment method and then complete the purchase. So be sure to fill out the email address field as this is still mandatory and at the same time, this is where the QR code will still be sent. Then tap purchase eSIM. Once you complete the payment, you will now arrive at this window where you will have two options of installation. You can choose install eSIM to this phone or install eSIM with QR code. So again, I would highly recommend that you choose install eSIM to this phone. So just give it some time to install and make sure that you don't disconnect from your internet. To activate eSIM, just tap on allow, then tap continue. Now just a quick note, you will notice that on this screen, I am being asked to turn off at least one of my two SIM cards. That's because there should only be two active SIMs at a time. Now, I'm not sure if this is only applicable for my device, iPhone 14 Plus. Let me know in the comments if you're able to have more than two active SIMs at a time. Alright, we've completed the installation. Now you have your new eSIM installed. No need for a QR code. I hope that helps, especially those who were not lucky enough to receive the QR codes. As always, if you have any questions, you can drop those in the comments and I'll try my best to answer them as soon as possible. If you wish to support this channel, please do so by giving this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you on the next one. Thank you for watching.